mixed martial arts is strong in, uh, in the French islands, uh, Trinidad and mostly the Latin American um, islands. Uh, Barbados is growing steady and, and we would like to um, see if it becomes a, a household name here in Barbados. Yeah, a call demand for women's fighting because you know the, the age of the age of the um, equal say, left feminism. <laughs> yeah, right, 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 right. Uh, you know, um, I, I guess we all over the um, run. Uh, Leila Ali, etc. Right, right, right. So we have two two females, one from Barbados, um, Aisha Dotton and um, Latoya Joseph from Trinidad, uh, who will be um, on future events. Um, Folks on the on the event, and that should at least stimulate some more female interest in the sport. Yeah. Um, I saw her once in action. We had a we had a kickboxing event, and uh, she she for me I, I I think she won the she won the bout. Um, just a, it was a little mistake on the referee in Barbados, and I can see that she's 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 a warrior, um, and I believe she's preparing very hard for the bout. Um, but you know, trained audience are. are, are very um, keen in sports because they, they have more um, more to work with. So it should be an interesting bout for all ladies coming to support athletes. The, uh, uh, I wouldn't use the word contract, but it's our contract. The athletes will want to prepare for the ticket accommodations. So then they are liable for um, any disruption of the um, of the of the of the tournament. So that's being a very look at, carefully look at and. Um, Again, we want to make it very professional, you know, more, uh, you know, lay back type of thing, you know, because mm -hmm. it, it's, it's a serious sport. And, um, and then we owe a lot to the, um, to the spectators. For the preparation for the fight is mostly a lot of cardio, because, you know, during these fights, they take a toxin on your body, so you have to keep cardio up. There's a lot of weight training, a lot of sparring, a lot of technique drills. <clears throat> and so far, it has been going great. What do you think of your opposition? Well, as far as I know, he's a very good fighter. But in this this case, I will be the one to be coming up on top. In terms of preparation, as, as Ronaldo said, it's a lot of cardio. I have to do a lot of cardio and a lot of sparring and do a lot of drills. So I have been doing that. And in terms of my opponent, um, he's basically like me, new to the sport. So, I would just play by ear in the ring. Don't get over anxious and just fight at a good pace. Um, being involved in martial arts and, and this type of martial arts, I should say, most persons might not be keen to, to buy into this type of, of mixed martial arts. What, what do you say as a competitor? As a competitor, I would say the, the mixed martial arts is the exciting sport. It's the only sport that blends all the martial arts together, whether it's boxing, kickboxing, wrestling, judo, it's the only sport you get to showcase all your skills in one event. And I would say for anyone who wants to do it, just take it in stages, have a background in something, whether it be judo, wrestling, kickboxing, and then work your way up till you get to the level of the MMA that you want to be at. Yeah, I'm a, I, I, would consider, I would consider myself to be a, a Bob Marley in, in martial arts, you know, I'm a rebel. Um, and some people like to stick to the traditional patterns of, of learning martial arts. So when the, the, the mixed martial arts come along, which is basically out of, out of Brazil, which was called um, Vale Tudo, um, and then it, the Americans take it and then uh, you know, play around a little bit and then adjust it and make it a little better. Um, so the problem we have today is in martial arts schools and martial arts coaches who have this, I don't know, resentment to the progress of the martial arts. Um, and not, because I see a lot of young people with a lot of talent who can be at transition and, and, if, and we can adjust the rules to suit the younger ones, make it safe. Uh, we call it um, the pancreation, which is very popular in growing pump. But a lot of martial arts schools still have this old mentality that, um, that this is considered to be a um, you know, uh, uh, brutal thing, um, which is not, because it, it, it takes skill, you know, skill. Right, uh, uh, fitness. Um, for me, you. for me as a martial arts, for me as a martial arts model of the year is like do British mm -hmm. and they can bear witness to me this.
lockdowns of all karate, judo, this, all this fighting. You know? mm-hmm. They need to get mixed martial arts. Mm-hmm. You know, um, and if they go to mixed martial arts, they see you guys going to work hard and then see they hug each other. I don't see that in, 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 in conventional um, um, okay. disciplines. And today, by our next event, which will be um, in December, we will officially have our, our uh, octagon. And we're looking so far to uh, take fires from uh, US, Canada, and Europe, and to go move towards the, uh, the professional arena. So things are looking very good um, in mixed martial arts. And we, we really, uh, really thank the press and the um, Bubble Sports Bar for coming to our support, uh, our lifting sport, and take the next level.